It's time for your red racing recap from Martinsville. The NASCAR Cup Series raced under the lights Wednesday night at Martinsville. The first stage saw a lot of unpredictability as without practice, half the field found themselves lapped during the first stage, including pole sitter Ryan Blaney. It was an uncharacteristically quiet night at Martinsville as there were very few on the track incidents. By the end of the race, only 14 cars finished on the lead lap as Martin Truex Jr. ran away from the competition, winning by over four seconds. Now, while tempers were not hot, Austin Dillon was feeling the heat as a blown tire on the opening laps damaged his crush panels, and he had to be helped out of his car before the race was over. Bubba Wallace brought his Black Lives Matter Chevrolet home in an impressive 11th. Sunday, NASCAR going to be racing in Homestead, Miami, a track that will not host the season finale for the first time in over 15 years with the last two races running green. Let us know in the comments how many cautions you think there's going to be on Sunday for a chance to win a family four pack of passes to Spring Carlisle with Carlisle events happening at the Carlisle Fairgrounds June 17th through the 20th.